Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia presents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast, Silesia Olive Gardens in Western Armenia are under threat. Road construction works continues in the capital city of Artsakh. Anti-Armenian xenophobia and racism by Azerbaijan recognize Artsakh, the village of Karagaluk. Russia has become a country against which the most general sanctions have been imposed. Activists advertise the Van Museum in Western Armenia. Culture in Western Armenia, the architect. A huge number of olive orchards planted and cultivated over the centuries in the Cilician province of Hatay in western Armenia make a great contribution both to the country's economy and to private entrepreneurs. Since 2002, attempts to search for energy, oil and natural gas, plundering olive orchards for the purpose of industry, tourism and construction have not been off the agenda. All this caused outrage of the people to the conversation of nature and agriculture. In this regard, the Coordinating Council of Academic Professional Chambers of Hatay and the platform of the Hatay branch of the Federation of Trade Unions converted a press conference to attach the attention to the competent authorities and to raise their voice of protest against the decision to grant olive orchards mining. According to them, instead of protecting agricultural territories, pastures, olive orchards and forests, the deployment of industrial activity in these territories is unacceptable. The government of Western Armenia is also against the similar illegal decisions. In Stepanakert, road construction works are continuing at the Nabirzhnya and Lazarus streets. Earthworks are being carried out, as well as works on the construction of decoration are being carried out on the necessary sections along the roads. The construction is carried out in Chanshin, CGSC. The report Anti-Armenian Xenophobia Racism in Azerbaijan 2021, created by the joint efforts of a number of human rights CSOs, is a continuation of the xenophobia in Azerbaijan report published last year. It summarizes the events of 2021 and the beginning of 2022, which create an atmosphere of fear, stimulate violence, and are a threat at the cleansing of Armenians. The material presented in the report reveals the ongoing genocidal intent of the Azerbaijan leadership against the indigenous Armenians of Artsakh, which hinders the reconciliation of peoples in the region and establishment of lasting peace. The report calls on the government of the Republic of Armenia and the international community to take effective measures to ensure the long-term and stable security of the Armenians of Artsakh, to condemn and call the account of Armenian hating policy of Azerbaijan. You can find more details on the following link below on our official website. Karagaluk, a village in the Hadrut region of the Republic of Artsakh, which is currently temporarily under the control of the armed forces of Azerbaijan. The village is located 9 km southwest of Hadrut, located on the eastern slope of Mount Dizapide. The community has a mountainous position. The climatic conditions are favorable. Most of the inhabitants are indigenous. In the early 1890s, there were 25 houses, 203 inhabitants, and 1897, there were 40 houses and 96 inhabitants. During the First Artsakh War in 1991, the village was destroyed by Azerbaijanis. In general, Karagaluk was a numerable village, and there were also very little population before the forcible seizure by Azerbaijan. The village has two churches, one of which is the Church of St. Astvazadzin, considered to be an 18th century structure. In 2012, the construction of new church in the village began, and it ended in 2014. Russia has become the country against which the largest number of sanctions have been imposed for several years, and since February 22, another 2,778 new restrictive measures have been introduced. This is reported by the investigative community of Constellum L Service. It is noted that taking into account the restrictions adopted before February 22, a total of 5,532 sanctions have been imposed against the Russian Federation since 2014 on March 7. Thus Thus, Russia is significantly ahead of Iran, Syria and North Korea. 3.6 thousand sanctions have been imposed against Iran, 2.6 thousand against Syria, 2.1 thousand against North Korea and 0.7 thousand against Venezuela. One of the most important cultural centers of Western Armenia, the Van Museum, was the final stage of European Museum Award 2022 competition organized by the Forum of European Museums. In order to make the museum's activities more widespread, a number of activists have taken measures. The advertising book and attention is paid to the historical, religious, cultural values and natural beauties for the basin of Lake Van and Van City. In addition to hundreds of numbers of associations of activists of Lake Van, nature lovers represent 
representatives of various public organizations, officials and thousands of interested users also contribute to the advertising work, which is carried out in writing on various social platforms. It should be noted that about 3,000 exhibits are on display in the Van Museum. The high level of social, economic and cultural development of Western Armenia is evidenced by the architectural monument of Ani and Ahtamar, Grigor Narikati's poem The Book of Mournful Songs and numerous achievements of Armenian historiography. Medieval cities are flourishing, new architectural solutions are emerging, new centers of Armenian architecture are performing, where new ones are being formed on the old traditions. In Western Armenia, architecture was based in the rich tradition of national culture. The period of Neolithic Revolution was of fundamental importance for the development of architecture. When the connecting properties of aluminium was invented, the first artificial building material was created, raw brick. Now the musical part, Armenian folk song. The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.